All right, so we're checking out this treadmill slash walking pad that was sent to me for testing and review. Now, this thing is actually going to be perfect if you have a standing desk, but you obviously could use this. I might just use this to watch TV uh, in the evenings when I'm done with work to walk on it uh, just because it does. It's now getting dark much earlier. Uh, we do have a remote right here and you can see that this thing actually does track your speed, time, distance, and the amount of calories burned all on this screen. And you do even have this switch that you flip on for it to work. Now, one thing I will note that I, I wish this was a little bit different. The power cable does not come off of the machine here. So you are going, if anything happens to this cable, you potentially might have to replace the whole thing. Whereas some other models, this is not uh, a, a deal. You can pull it in and out, kind of like a normal computer plug. But overall, this thing is super nice. We do have a wireless remote here, which is pretty cool. So you're just gonna hold this and you can see that it is now counting down on the screen. Um, you can see that the screen is now counting down and we have been walking. If I press the up arrow, it's gonna go faster, down arrow is gonna go slower, and then obviously I could hit the stop button and it's gonna slowly wind it down. If I hit the play again, we're gonna count down. Three, two, one, go. It starts at 0 0.6, but that is the lowest it goes, just so you know. But obviously you can go a lot higher than that but overall this thing is pretty nice to walk on let's go ahead and hit stop uh, and it is very easy to maintain so it comes with this wireless remote obviously um, and then it also comes with this little packet of tools here you have your allen wrenches uh, and some silicone oil for you to oil up the uh, the actual walking uh, pad here. And those Allen wrenches are for you to kind of center th this right here because obviously it could uh, somehow start uh, going more to one side or the other. And that is how you adjust it there. So this is the underside of the walking pad slash treadmill. And you can see that the front has wheels because that's because you can lift up the back end and it does make it easier to move it uh, i have carpeted floors so obviously this would be even easier if you had hardwood or you know just kind of uh, more solid floors and not carpeted you do have these rubberized feet here on the bottom so you're not going to scuff up your floor or anything like that but i will say um this is exposed on the underside here, so you are gonna have to be careful where you do place this. Overall, this is not that heavy, um, but you do wanna make sure you keep everything lubricated while you are using this. Personally, I personally I like that this is just kind of like a solid black color, super simple, super easy to use, which also means it's gonna be easy to maintain as well. Last thing to note about this treadmill is that they do have a, a app. It is called the WellFit app, as you can see right here. And it is on both iPhone and Android. So what's really nice about this is that this does give you a way uh, to actually control your treadmill in case you lose that wireless uh, controller, in case you lose this controller right here. Um, and honestly, that is probably the best thing about this app. Now they do offer a bunch of like classes you can see right here. You can go to competition training. There are like some free courses and stuff like that that you can take, which are pretty cool that this does this. The app is a little bit finicky, so that is something to take note of. For instance, like it asked me for my height and it said feet. And then when I put that in, it converted it to centimeters, but it wasn't correct. And same with the weight, it was asking uh, for pounds and then it put it in kilograms. So 
the app does need some work but they do offer all these like free things right here but honestly the best part about this app is that if you lose that controller you can still turn on and off your treadmill which is a huge huge factor so you just go here you connect it via bluetooth you can hit you hit go you're going to select either like smart run free run or target run i would just go with free run personally and then it is connecting and then it for some reason it gives like this and you can see the treadmills counting down with it and now we are moving and this is going to allow you to even turn up the speed you can see here honestly i wish it was just like a normal uh controller that instead of it having to like do all of this i i really wish that the app just had like control your treadmill on off speed and and you could hold your phone like this instead of having to do it like this but this way the treadmill is not useless in case you lose that controller and they do have all this stuff i would dig into a lot of those courses they are pretty cool but overall very nice treadmill definitely going to start using this underneath my standing desk and it's going to work out really nicely